Welcome back, guys. Back here in the garden here at the MMP's Day's Creation. Look at these girls. Just explosive. 2020 can never be too soon to start preparing your outdoor garden, guys. So, as soon as 2019 was done and all the girls were out, my goats went into that cage to eat the stalks and do everything that they like to do in there and also to start conditioning that soil guys so how we are going to be doing the conditioning of the soil and also building up the soil to well the garden ecosystem I should say the building up the garden ecosystem is we are going to be working with companion planting guys now if you guys are not familiar with like companion planting you guys are gonna have to definitely study up on that but I'll drop some information here for you as much as I can guys so what I am going to be working with is, I'm just going to ramble off a few that I remember. Uh, I got dill, basil, sunflower, alfalfa, some lavender, uh, and a few of them that I just can't remember or pronounce. So, the dill, the dill is going to be very... Uh, very nice in the garden right along with the basil and now I will list what each one does rather than go on and keep this video for going on and on but at the end of this video I will post a informational segment so you guys can see what I am talking about now with companion planting you are literally just mimicking nature guys everything that is going on in this just just say the jungle or uh, the deep deep country with with no disturbance guys so you have got everything helping out each other and just thriving off one another so that's what we're trying to build up here because nobody or nothing likes to be alone guys so we are just building up these girls, just making them stronger, making them healthier, just building up that soil. Oh yes, one thing, one more thing I am doing. I am going around and I am cutting down the cover crop that is in this soil. I'm cutting it down and I'm just like giving it a little toss and spreading it out. I'm gonna put a thin layer of uh, worm castings on this and we're trying to create a humic layer and we'll top dress it again with cover crop but cover crop guys I'm using uh, crimson seed the red clover white clover uh, and there's other there's other um, cover crops that you guys can use but that's what I got what's what I can use in and Yes, it is helping aerate the soil and just build up that plant, guys. Just give it that buddy that it's needing, that companion. So, guys, we have got a little bit of room in between these plants. We are going to be switching from a 10 by 10 room to a 16 by 20. Give these girls the space that they need. So, I'm going to try to keep this video short, but stop in and check out the soil web at the end of this video, and this is what we are trying to mimic, guys. We are just trying to provide for outdoors with the animals, the fertilizer that just nature is out there just given, you know, and also just trying to build up the fungi and all the microbes and everything that we can to mimic nature guys it's an ecosystem that we are trying to mimic and that's what we are trying to do so 
go get you guys some companion planting. Do what I'm doing, a stocking up for 2020, guys. So 2020 season, here we come. I am actually, yes, stocking up on a few different things. A few different things, you know. The cover crop, the companion planting, um, and like my seed sprout teas, guys. Seed sprout teas and my top dressing amendments. So we are gonna be doing everything that we can to keep salt levels down, keep everything, everything organic. So we are trying to stay away from pesticides by using cover crop and your cover crop, or not cover crop, I'm so sorry for saying cover crop, your companion planting. So your basil, your dill, your everything like that, each one is going to have a different purpose, guys, or some of them is going to be the same thing that they help out with. Maybe one might add another thing as a alfalfa or aphids and white flies or uh, you know one might pick up a extra benefit but guys but don't think that adding too many companion planting is too much guys so that's what we're gonna be doing stocking up on your lavender and ones that we can't pronounce our sunflowers just dill basil so many ones guys that we cannot just I could list them off for a good five minutes and yes it'll if you're like me it's easier to read it and absorb it so stay tuned to the end of this video and check out your soil web and information on companion planting guys go stock up on your top dressing amendments, your companion planting seeds and cover crop. You know, this is what I am doing for outdoors and also taking care of the animals outdoors, guys. So goats are an amazing uh, animal. You know, they're, they got just two, like, it takes double the amount of manure from a cow or horse to meet the same MPK value for a goat and goat uh, poop is not like hot you know so it's quick and easy to work with you know that's a whole different thing you know we're going to be talking about that something else so you know this is what we're talking about guys is companion planting and what we are preparing our plants for so I'm gonna be going around and like I said chopping down these this uh, cover crop everything's looking good guys oh sorry and yes we're just tilling it up Tilling it up and covering it up a little bit with some more uh, worm castings, guys. So, yes, soon enough, I'm going to probably move these, probably at the end of February, move them to a 16 by 20 room, guys. A little bit more space, get it up out of this garage. All right, guys, I'm going to let you get back to your chores as I do mine. Roll them if you got them, guys. Grow them if you don't. Grow your own happiness and smoke your worries away, guys. Stay tuned. And, well, as you can see, we are running out of space. I say about another two weeks in this room, if that, maybe about ten days. That's why I say the end of February, and we'll be done. I got about four, not even four foot left to go, guys, in here. Not even, I would say about two, three foot, about, let's say three foot to work with, with these girls, so. These 16 plants have tore up 
this room. Explosive growth, guys, so. Stay tuned, guys. This is MMP's Nation's creation. Signing out.